Yo, let's read between these bars. Shout out to the homie Blaze for the recommendation. I meant to get to this a long time ago, but I got caught up in reading Mad Mad Messages. This is for you, homie. The hell was Sway Lee saying? All that mushy mouth shit. What the hell was that? Sounded like Lana Del Rey. Memories. The weird shit is, is by the end of the song, he finally opens his damn mouth. It's like he woke up out of his damn dream and like actually start. By the way, that's the only piece of Sway Lee you're going to hear because this shit got blocked. I went to check for copyrights. So you're gonna hear. <laughs> you're gonna hear Homer serenade. Alright, we're gonna <laughs> let's skip the Kendrick's verse. Jokes aside, though, like the synths and the it's a simple as airy as beat. Couple of kicks in there. It's not. It's there's there's it's a very airy beat, but the way that it's all. Put together if you listen to this shit on like a good system man bro at night it should have put you in a daze them down do, 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 do. in the background and shit and you got this mushy mouth motherfucker singing in your it's just a, the ambience oh man this is this shit is just dope we part our first person i even see school chain and Man, I'm in the trust of wearing weapon with the vamps and lane. That was Gucci Mane's verse, sorry. <laughs> Kung Fu Kenny, yeah, let love me. Who the fuck you talking to? You made me, you made me. Last fucking place I'd expect to get the lyrics correctly. But this was old as fuck. This is back when they gave a fuck about getting the lyrics right. And they actually had a quote from B-Dot on here, which is even doper. But they got the lyrics right. He was calling him Manny, not who the fuck you ain't me, ain't me. He ain't say it four times. He said, who the fuck you Manny? He must know or some shit about Drake being a crazy motherfucker because he always calling him Manny. This is like the third song I've heard him talking about going Manny or calling him Manny. It's just a pattern. You can identify patterns. I'm not saying it's not like, oh, every song he says, bitch. No, it's when he's specifically targeting or sending shots towards Drake. He'll say something about acting mania or going mania or calling him mania or something like that. And he's in his Kung Fu Kenny form. When you see Kung Fu Kenny, about to beat your ass. Salute me when I'm walking through you, ain't me, ain't me. Am I her love me unconditional? No. You'll hurt like you catch you on the instrumental though. He's talking about all these squares, bro, not just Drake. Everybody paying for protection. Shouting them out on the instrument. <laughs> Shouting them out on the instrumental. Just for the, have him shaking ass in the video and all of that. But the follow up bars to that reference nope. will be died. This rap shit crazy need the woo side. They screaming God must be two sides. I rap beat a shoddy low, you beat that door flex. In reference to the bars you just heard, Brian B. Dot Miller is a respected journalist. Let's just get that out the way first. Let's say I read some word that they're homies, but I don't know. All right. If you're not looking at it, during the Soldier Boy and Chris Brown feud, SB claimed he was from Compton. Since everyone knows his origins are based in the South. I jokingly texted Kendrick, a CPT native. Soldier Boy from Compton. Must be two sides. RP Shawty Love. Also, Soldier Boy is from like 30 different fucking states, bro. He, he's from fucking Mississippi. This motherfucker from Atlanta. At one time, he was saying he was from Bompton. Oh, what the fuck? Until he got pressed by some actual pyros and shit. And What's up, blood? What's up, blood? <laughs> It's Compton though. Yeah. You're not from Compton? I am from Bompton. You from Compton? Yeah, I'm from Bompton, yeah. I thought you from Mississippi somewhere. Nah, nah, I'm from Bompton. I'm from California, Bompton, yeah. How? What you mean how? Where you from? South Carolina? Yeah, yeah. How you from there? I was born and raised there. <laughs> okay, believe that. You was born in Compton? Nah, I was born in Chicago. I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> Sit your nipple head ass down somewhere, bitch. Fuck is you talking about Soldier Wayne grew up in the A? Bitch, you don't know me, you don't know shit about me. You fat head, limp head, wop head, wobble head, bitch. Fuck you talking about, nigga, this Simpson Rose on one way. I mean, that right there is indeed a shining example, but not the only example. There's so many damn frauds out here and fucking rapping hip. It's crazy, bro. Go listen to Doom, Bati Boys. Everybody wants to get all up in arms because he's like, oh, Doom was just being homophobic. Up. That's not even what the song's focus was. This is so sidetracked. It, the MF Doom ain't got shit to do with none of this. Go listen to Bati Boys. Title is crazy. Like, if you know what that means, you know what that means. Oh, shoot. Get a load of that fruit and thigh high boots, red tidy whities and blue cat suit. All right. <laughs> but still, man, there's too many of these motherfuckers taking the egg test, bro. If you know what the egg, 
It's just nasty out here, homie. Can't, I don't care. The egg joke is from Thought Crimes. You heard it first. I like me a bougie hoe from no my dear West. 2017, or to pick a ding. Zig it. I got a smaller team. Got a bigger ring. Bigger ring. Everybody a crib till they black and blue. Everybody a blood till they hemorrhaging. Everybody a crib till they black and blue. Homer talking that shit, bro. Well, it's a smaller team and the ring flip. That was a flip on Drake's big rings. We need some really big rings, really big team. Like, some of these shots are real obvious. I don't really feel the need to. Dope ass song, though. Flew over my head. Shout out to Ariel. He, he said some funny ass shit about Sway Lee. <laughs> Back when they used to make hits, huh, Ariel? Since I started talking about it, I'm about to break it down. Bati boys. I'm breaking that down next. Stick. I'm sticking to it, too. I gotta stick to a doom. If I'm talking about anything doom, I'm sticking to it because that's my that's my inspiration right there. That's why I wear the mask. That's why I flip the bars the way that I flipped and you don't know what the fuck I'm. Man, bro. Ugh. RP Doom. Catch you on the next one. Like and subscribe, love, shout out, thought crime.